Lynx Air is one of Canada's newest ultra-affordable airlines. At the start of the year, they launched non-stop service from Toronto's YYZ to Orlando's MCO Terminal C, and it is one of the cheapest tickets on any airline. I had the chance to try out the flight. I'm going to show you around the plane with some details about how they operate. Lynx has brand new Boeing 737s that can seat up to 187 passengers. And unlike some cheap airlines, they actually have great leg room. I sometimes feel cramped on other planes, but I wasn't with Lynx. With your ticket, you can bring one small personal item on board the size of a purse or laptop bag, and then you'll pay for seat selection, carry-on bags, or check bags. What you'll get is a comfortable flight, and I have to say the overhead bins are nice and large compared to other airlines with older planes. Okay, what do you think of the new planes? They're really cozy, I have to admit, way better than you expect from an affordable airline. Really lots of space, great, great seats, everything. It's fantastic, very cool, prompt, very good staff. Love it. To keep prices low, the airline doesn't offer entertainment or snacks, but they do bring around water during the flights, the staff are friendly and professional, and the seats are comfortable. I had great service on my flight to and from Orlando. They actually got us to Orlando early on the trip down, and coming back, it was perfectly on time. From Pearson Airport, Lynx flies from Terminal 1, and they have staff where you can check in and drop your check bags and you'll get a better rate on baggage if you prepay online before your flight. Lynx serves a number of Canadian destinations as well as a few US cities, and those include service from Calgary to Las Vegas, Phoenix, and LA. For the Orlando flight from Toronto, flights are offered right now on Mondays, Wednesdays, Fridays, and Sundays, departing Toronto at 9 a.m., with return flights departing Orlando at 1.15 p.m., and that's, of course, subject to change. From Toronto, you can also fly to Calgary, Edmonton, Fredericton, Halifax, Kelowna, St. John's, Vancouver, and Winnipeg. And I priced at most flights at well under the other airlines. Just be sure to compare prices depending on how much luggage you need to bring. As a cheap alternative to vacationing in Orlando, perhaps even before you head on a cruise in Port Canaveral, you can save a fair bit of money with links, especially when you have small children who don't need carry-on luggage or check bags. If you're prepaying for your seat and then just bring one check bag or one carry-on bag, you'll save anywhere from $100 to $200 per person compared to other airlines. For the best experience, we pack some snacks for the plane as well as to drink, and we download a movie to our devices. There's no Wi-Fi on the plane, so you should download from the airport Wi-Fi or at home before you leave. Here's a peek at MCO's new Terminal C where Lynx arrives in Orlando. It's a really sleek new space with 15 gates, a number of restaurants, retail stores, including a Disney store, and the Universal store with their dragon. As well, you'll find a Plaza Premium Lounge, lots of places to sit or work, and there's of course parking, as well as car rental stations. I love how open and bright the whole terminal is. It feels like the perfect welcome to Orlando. It is bright and refreshing. Stay tuned for my full video coming up soon on the terminal and check out my other videos on Orlando and my channel from recent trips to Universal, Disney World, as well as Gatorland. And I have more videos coming up soon. Thank you very much for watching. If you can, if you'd like, leave this video a like and subscribe if you feel like it. That would be greatly appreciated.